So this really matters for one important reason. If we don't make some change, either legally or at least culturally, we're going to be stuck with a two-party system. And what that means is bad, bad, bad ideas. Because the ideas aren't new and fresh, the ideas are, how can I stop the other guy? The negative campaigning that we hate so much, that this guy's bad, this guy's bad, this guy's bad, that campaigning doesn't stop if there's only two parties. Why? Because it works. We've been spending 30 years saying, that guy's worse than me, that guy's worse than me. But think about it, if we get a third or a fourth voice, and I say, that guy's worse than me, there's two other choices. Maybe I don't get that vote, which means I stop. It turns campaigning away from the, they're evil, they're bad, mudslinging, into we have to have new ideas. Do we want to bring our nation forward? Then we have to make this happen. New ideas, innovation, moving forward. Can you talk about how including the LP or the Green Party can make the old parties even better? Absolutely. Right now you find the parties right now, they're basically tribes. Uh, they have a Democrat and a left and, and a Democrat and Republican tribe where all we care about is fighting the other. So our principles are gone, right? Democrats are supposed to be about, about civil liberties. Republicans are supposed to be about respecting that tax base and growing small business. Neither is true anymore. They're not, and they don't care. They care about winning. But if all of a sudden now there's a Green or a Libertarian or Independent in there, that person now can say, wait a minute, you guys are supposed to be about X and Y and Z. You better actually have those principles. So even if you're a Democrat or Republican, you're probably unhappy with your party because they haven't cared about your principles in years. This happens, your party, Democrat or Republican, will be a better party for you.